What's going on, Team Fresh? Welcome back to a new Forza Horizon 5 video. Today we have something exciting, guys. I just hopped into uh, my Lamborghini Huracan Evo. It's a 2020 edition. It looks absolutely sick in this matte gray color. Anyway, today we are going to be doing something really exciting. Something I've been wanting to do for a very long time. And that is we're going to be doing a barn find. That's right. There is somewhere in this vicinity. There is a barn. An abandoned barn. Where we can find an abandoned vehicle. And uh, we can collect it. So, anyway, we're going to put this on the GPS. We're going to head over there and we're going to look for whatever vehicle it is. It's going to be a surprise. So, yeah, I'm really excited about today's video. Hope you guys are as well. Yards. Turn right. And, uh, yeah, I actually haven't driven this car. Turn right. I do have, um, I do have another vehicle, another Lamborghini. Another Huracan, but it's an LP670, I want to say. It's a different one from this one. But I picked out this one for today's video because I haven't driven it. And also, another thing is, it's all-wheel drive. Well, the other one is all-wheel drive also. Oh, uh, but, oh, let's actually hit this thing here. Woo! All right. Yeah, this is an all-wheel drive vehicle. We're going to be doing some off-roading today. So... Yeah, I was like, why not take a Lambo today? Typically, you wouldn't be driving a Lambo in these conditions, uh, but what do I care, right? I have so many different cars. <laughs> All right, here we go. We're going to try and use the handbrake and go. Woo! Well, that was a fail. <laughs> All right, anyway. We have about four and a half miles left to go. Dude, this car sounds absolutely insane. Look at this interior view, though. Wow. I love it. Which view do you guys like the most, actually? Let me know in the comment section down below. Oh, there's that turn right here. I almost just went past it. We're good, though. We are good. I kind of like this hood view because you can hear the exhaust a little bit better. And you can see the outside a lot better as well. All right. I wonder if we're close to that place where we're supposed to go and look for the barn. I think we'll be able to see it on the mini map. Whoa, whoa, whoa. There we go, guys. This, this kind of reminds me of Dirt Rally <laughs> driving like this. Whew. Turn right. I'm turning right. Okay. All right. Calm down. Whoa, 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 whoa. I know a lot of you guys like the third person view. So I'm going to try and mix it up just so you guys can see the car as well. Let's try and open it up here. I wonder if it's anything like Forza Horizon 2. I think the second one is the one that I've played the most. Where if you get closer to the barns, and I just totally <laughs> wrecked that. Oh, but we're getting points for that. So, but yeah, I wonder if it's anything like the Forza Horizon 2 where if you get closer to the barn, it'll start beeping. And the closer you get, like, the louder it starts beeping. I wonder if it's anything like that. Oh, but I guess we're going to find out very shortly. How far away? Well, we're only 1.8 miles away. We're, we've actually done a lot of work. Yeah, driving with this view, I just... I find it a lot more comforting, I guess. A lot more confidence inspiring. Oh, I see it. I see the sphere, the blue giant circle that you guys see on the mini map right now. That's where we have to start looking for the abandoned um, 
barn. Hopefully with the vehicle there. All right, let's hit this. Let me know what you guys think about this specific view. I think the car just sounds absolutely insane with this view. Also, like, controlling the car is just a little bit easier for me, for whatever reason. Like, as soon as I jump out into this view, it becomes a little bit disconnected. Like, the whole feel of the car. Let's drift this corner. Whoa! Okay. Let's get back on this road. If you can even call it a road. Yeah, there's something about this that just kind of feels a little off. <laughs> I gotta get used to playing this game in the third person view. Alright, we're gonna do this crazy jump here. Whoa! <laughs> Alright, so I think um, we are technically in the vicinity right now. There's a guy over there. I wonder if he found uh, this, um, the barn. If so, that might be cheating a little bit, but yeah, there's this hidden trail that's not even on the map. I wonder if that's where it is. I think so. Oh my gosh, man. That would be cheating, but is this it? I think so. <laughs> well, thank you very much, man. We kind of cheated. I saw the guy in the map and I'm like, let's go. All right, let's see what happens. What kind of a car is inside? It is Uncle Victor's car. Ford Escort. It has to be. It's an Escort? Less than a quarter of the field made it to the finish line in Mexico City. But five out of the top ten were these things. That's how we got the name. Wow. Wow. That's kind of cool. We got an old school Ford Escort. All right, guys. So here's the status on our barn find vehicle. This is the car that we found, which is the Racing Escort MK1. Basically, just being restored right now. And unfortunately, there's nothing I can do. Well, I could spend 350,000 credits, but that's a crazy amount of credits to spend just to fix up this car now when we can buy new cars and things like that so I'm not gonna do that you know the guy is working on it it's going to take some time the next day all right guys so it took some time to restore the escort here we go this is it right here racing escort mk1 from 1967 this is a little bit old it has 200 horsepower 160 pound feet of torque uh always a little over 2,000 pounds and it's 1.8 liter real wheel drive fun looking car anyway let's go ahead and collect it right now this barn find has now been added to your garage oh, i've been trying to like find it an old friend again Take but good oh care of this one. my gosh, <laughs> take a look at this. This is what we found for free. And uh, yeah, dude, this is this is amazing. We can actually change up You're the camera here a little bit. This, but you've earned a gift drop from another driver. Just doing a normal walk around this vehicle and it just looks absolutely amazing. Take a look at this. Whew. Look at the interior too. It's got racing seats over there. We have a roll cage. This thing is kind of cool. Let's actually take it for a quick spin. I want to see what it's like to drive. Yeah. Compared to the Lambo, it's kind of nice. Uh, but, or I mean, the Lambo looks a little bit better, I think. Uh, but, regardless, here we go. We have collected this Escort. And, uh, yeah, we are ready to take it for a quick spin just to see what it sounds like, what it handles like. All right, here are the collection of all the Fords that we have. This one's a legendary. I wonder how much money it's worth. Well, anyway, let's go ahead and get inside. We're going to take it for a quick spin. <laughs> wow, it did not look like this when we first... Um, when we first found it. So we can actually customize it, but mm, you know what? Maybe at a later 
point in time, we'll do that. For right now, I just want to take it for a quick spin. <laughs> Little backfires too? Alright, let's see. Wow. Let's go. Wow, this is this is cool. Let me actually change up the camera really quickly. It's got mud flaps in the back too. Dude! The interior looks really sick. Woo! <laughs> It is a little slow. I gotta, I gotta say, but it does handle pretty decent. Look at this, and the sound is so sick. Wow. Hold on. Let's hear uh, the exterior sound. It's actually pretty quick for such an old car. Like, back in the day, I'm sure this was a rocket ship. Dude, this is awesome. I can't believe we just found this car, got it for free. Love Forza Horizon 5. Hope you guys do as well. Anyways, I'm gonna end today's video right here. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, you guys already know what to do. Let me know in the comment section down below if you guys want me to do more barn find videos because um, there were actually quite a lot more vehicles that we could find and restore. But anyway, I'm going to sign out right here. See you guys all in the next one. Peace out.